And we back. It's been a while since we posted about the joggers, almost 20 days to be exact. And in those 20 days, we gained thousands of new legends that decided to click that button and subscribe to the channel. So it's time to bring them back because everyone deserves to know about these joggers glitches. So let's go. We'll start with the pink. I want you guys to comment which ones you want to see next. And within the upcoming week, I got you guys. Also, make sure you leave a like. And if you guys really can help me out, we're only 3,000 off from 60k. I know for a fact that more than 3,000 people are going to watch this video. So I need your help. You, I'm talking to you, man. If you just go down there, it's free. Click a button. It really, really means a lot to me. You guys also really helped the channel in the videos. But now let's get into it. So step one, we're going to need to start into story mode and launch up director mode. This is the best way in the game. Plus, you get to keep all your outfits. From the last few videos, you lost your outfits. So we're done with that. We're back on keeping the outfits. From here, you want to go down to online characters. And you'll notice you have your GTA Online. From here, you want to click Triangle or Y on Xbox. By the way, this is PS4 and Xbox. PC could do this as well. It's all consoles. From here, we're going to go. We're going to go ahead up to Animals. You'll notice once you go into Animals, you're going to have a bird. If you don't have a bird, search Bird Peyote Plant. From here, you want to go and click Triangle or Y once again to shortlist this as well. Yeah, again, if you don't have the bird, make sure you search on YouTube how to get the bird GTA. It works with any bird but the hen. So anyone works from here. You want to exit the story mode and close app and load straight onto online. So you need to close app. You can't load on from normally. Once you load onto online, you want to go and come to the time trail of the week, which is right here, Stab City. It just switched this Thursday, which was yesterday. Also, I'm sorry if I'm a bit low. I'm recording in the middle of the night all the time now. My schedule's been messed up. From here, you want to go take off all masks and then go and throw on a parachute. And then you just want to get in any streetcar. It doesn't matter what outfit you're wearing as long as you got a parachute on and you take off all the masks. From here, start the time trail and switch on to your solo character. So for me, I'll, I was using Franklin, so I'm going to go to him. It works with Michael and Trevor as well, but just do it with Franklin, you know? I'm doing with Franklin. It's just, it's just easier. If you follow exactly what I do, there shouldn't be any mistakes, and it's just it's, it's so much easier, you know? So we are just about to load into story mode. As you guys can see, we're at Franklin. And from here, we've got to go and hold the touchpad once again and launch up director mode. So now it's just going to take us back. If you get an auto save, this is very important. You want to confirm that or else your outfit won't save. So make sure you click accept and accept the auto save. If you click no, then you're going to, it's just not going to save anything and you'll just lose the outfit at the end anyway. From here, you want to go down to your shortlist actors, which is the third one. And you'll notice that you're going to have your online and the bird both there from before. What you want to do from here is tie a wire elastic, I do my PlayStation charger, around your left stick of your controller pointing up. This is going to allow your birds to duplicate like as you guys can see on the screen right now. So you're just going to hold this. This takes exactly 27 minutes. Well, it's around from 25 to 30, but I think the exact time is in the 27 minute range. I got no clue why that's the time, but your birds are going to duplicate a lot. So I'm obviously not going to make you guys hold your left stick up for half an hour because that would be like pointless and no one's going to do that. So that's what I'm saying, tied up in an elastic or whatever. So I'm going to see you guys once we completed duping the birds. All right, so it's been about 25 minutes. Now look how many birds we got here on the haystack. You know what we want now? It's our character to go with the birds on the haystack. So you'll notice in a few seconds we're going to have our character appear. Perfect time for you guys to be smashing the subscribe button. I hate always saying it, like every two minutes, but if you don't say it, no one does it. You know what I'm saying? So i got to keep reminding at least like three times a video. One in the intro, one in the middle, and then one near the end. So in the upcoming seconds, we're going to find ourselves on the haystack with the birds right here. We'll be wearing this like weird outfit. You'll have a crew color t-shirt and the random jeans and checkerboard shoes. As you know, it's all working. From here, take your control out of the elastic or out of the wire. You'll be sitting here. Click circle. Then you want to head up to actors. You want to head down and select beach bums. So click A or X on beach bums. And from here, you want to start clicking square or X on Xbox just to go through all these modded outfits right here. What we're looking for is the pink joggers and any Christmas mask. A few don't let you transfer, so the reindeer and the Santa Claus do not get those two. Any other Christmas mask, you're able to transfer over onto online. So, for me, it didn't take me that long to find it actually this time. But this whole process can take really, really long. As you guys can see, I found it right here. We got that Christmas tree mask, we got Tron shoes, and we got pink joggers. So once you find the outfit, you just want to click triangle to shortlist it. 
but again it can take really long so if you guys want to see how to freeze the christmas mask go and watch this video i'll put a tag up for it right now so again here's my outfit it's all ready and then you want to go down the shortlist actors i shortlisted a few more but obviously we're going to pick this one then you just want to click x and take it into director mode so from here, it's just going to go and bring you in a random location. It don't really matter. And all you want to do is walk around from 20 or 30 seconds. So we're just going to spawn onto a side of the hill here. You'll notice you're going to be most of the time wearing a parachute. For whatever reason, mine didn't load in. But you'll have your modded outfit and a parachute. With the joggers, it doesn't matter what color that you do get. But you do have full customization over it. So you're able to put any shirt, any shoes on. For some reason, I lucked out so hard and got the Tron shoes which is extremely, extremely rare to match that with joggers and a Christmas mask. So that's lucky, I mean. So again, walk around for 10 to 20 seconds. It don't really need to be that long, but the longer, the better. Just because if you go too quick, it's going to glitch out and nothing's going to load in. You make a blue screen. From here, you just want to go and hold down on the D-pad and then switch on to your story mode. It'll put you back into story mode. Right here, go and call up a friend or someone in the comments if you guys want. And they just got to go online and invite you to Crooked Cop. So that's all they gotta do. They don't need to help you out in any way. They just need to go online, launch Crooked Cop, and invite you. My friend took about 15 years, so that's why I turned nighttime. And you'll notice you get the invite, so just join through your phone, and it's gonna take you right into online wearing the outfit. Again, you don't lose any of your outfits, so don't worry, you do get to keep them all. From here, you'll notice you and your friend are here, and the one setting they need to turn on is put clothing onto player owned. It's gonna start on classic, they wanna just put it on player owned. You'll notice you're wearing the modded outfit, you just want to leave the job on that screen. Click circle or B and exit out. Now you'll notice you load straight into online with wearing that outfit, but your game will crash. You want to accept the crash message and it's going to take you back into story mode. Once you load into story mode, you just want to walk around again for another about 5 to 10 seconds and close your application and load back onto online. After you close your application, you make sure you gotta load onto online right away. If you go straight to story mode, it won't work. You'll mess it all up. So you gotta make sure straight to online. So right when you get the option, straight online, and then you'll go. For the most part, once you load in, you're gonna have that outfit. So I'm gonna show you guys me customizing it and all that. As you guys see, we load in right now in the casino. And we got this modded outfit, so now we can do whatever we want with it. If you guys made it to the end of the glitch, make sure you do like the video. Also, subscribe if you haven't already. It means a lot to me. Right now I'm going to show you guys a modded outfit with it, because why not, just to add some to the video. Plus it ain't 10 minutes, I can be honest. I try posting them under. I, I try. Yesterday's video was under 10 minutes, but they just don't get recommended nearly, nearly as much. So, uh, I'm sorry. I'll show you guys a modded outfit to make up for it. I hope that works. Anyway, let's get into that. If you're cutting out now, though, subscribe the way out, though. Have a great day. Now let's get into the modded outfit part. So this is the outfit, nothing crazy, but you guys always seem to like the more simple ones and kind of the army themed here. Of course, no one's going to be wearing bright pink pants in the military, but we'll go with it, you know. So you're going to head down to utility vest, which is number 50, and you're going to go and buy number 3, the light strike vest. This is going to be this armored plate. Any of them do work, so it's whatever you prefer, whatever you think's the nicest. Me, I like number 3. From here, we're going to go and head up to sweaters. And you're going to go and buy this black turtleneck. It's number 69. Pause. And you're going to go and buy that. I don't know why I paused after that. It's just, uh, bro, I'm tripping nowadays, man. It's too late at night. I don't even know what I'm saying half the time. After you buy this, you're going to go and head over to the accessories rack. And you go down to gloves. And this could be any black gloves look best. But I'm going to go 64 to 64, the black tack gloves. After this, we're going to go, and you can put any shoes that you really want on. But since, again, I lucked out and got the Tron shoes, we're going to leave those on. Because I think they're dope, and that's really, really rare to get. But as you guys can see, I'm not going to lie to you guys. You could switch. You got invisible ankles for life. And also, if you didn't get the pink ones, this, this outfit looks cool with pretty much any joggers. Even the black ones. All black looks clean. From here, we're going to go and show how to get this helmet, mask, and all that. So see you guys once we're at the mask store. Alright yo, so we just pulled up to the mask store. From here we're just gonna go we're gonna go and head down to Diamond Casino Heist and buy number sixteen out of one oh four. Also in that last clip I had no audio, but you might want to put a parachute on, it looks better. So I like this because it matches perfectly. The mask and the joggers are the exact same color, and that's pretty rare to find. 
After this, you want to go and get this, uh, what's it called, bulletproof helmet right here. I'm pretty sure everyone in the game is going to have this by now. It's been out for almost six years now, and it's a common helmet that everyone has. To put these two together, all you got to do is a telescope glitch. I'm pretty sure all you guys know how to do that, but I'll show it. So you'll be wearing the diamond casino heist, run by the telescope, hold the touchpad, go down to style, and you go and put on this helmet right here. After you put on the helmet, it works with any helmet, but of course we're going to be getting the black bulletproof. We're just going to walk away and you'll notice they merge. That's a wrap for the video. If you guys made it to the end, I kept your attention for this long. You must have enjoyed something. Peace.